Welcome back to the Legend of Heroes Trails to Azure, uh, where we just started a new day in what was chapter 2 or 3? 2, right? 2, yeah. And today, we want to begin with our jobs. The first thing we do is this quest that is was modded in. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I have been requested to wait here on behalf of a certain distinguished person. A uh, distinguished person? I'm afraid I cannot disclose their identity. You are in a Liberian Royal Guard uniform. Who should we assume it is? My employer is very busy, so they cannot spare much time. Despite this, they have a task they wish to ask of the SSS. It sounds like this person has some particular circumstances. However, as it is but a personal request, I do not wish to over encumber you if you are already occupied. That said, I would take it as a personal favor if you were willing to accept this request. They said to bring you if you were willing to spare the time. This person sounds very busy indeed. Concretely, what time span are you talking about? They have public matters to attend to around noon, so this would have to take place in the morning. Public matters, that's something. We don't have much time to spare, but I'm curious about this request. What do you think, Lloyd? Let me think. Go on. You have my thanks. Please follow me, I will lead you to my employer. Just confirming, but is this meeting inside the city? It is. I believe it is somewhere you are already acquainted with, in fact. It's an airship currently on standby in the airport. We are sail. We are sail. That must mean your employer is... What? No way. Yes, she would be very busy indeed. Public matters at noon checks out. Sure, the trade conference. We met, members of the SSS. I apologize for summoning you for but a personal matter. No, it's fine, but I'm curious what this personal matter entails. Yes, it's not a matter I am personally in favor of. What is this about? She seems to be in a bad mood. I can only hope there's a good explanation for this. The princess did secretly summon us yesterday too. Maybe she's upset about that? So this is Captain Schwartz. Getting to meet Senior Captain Schwartz, it's almost like a dream come true. You met yesterday. Yes, it definitely is. Oh, I haven't gotten an autograph yet. I'm sure Joanna wanted one. Oh, you too? Actually, my mom asked for one too. Well, why don't we ask together? Yes, let's ask her! Would you two please calm down? We are on active duty. Oh, sorry. You say that you thought, but you're not different when it's about that. Yes, when it comes to that, you get rather... What are you talking about? I'm always calm and collected. Not when it's about Mishi. Hello, everyone. I'm glad you could make it. Princess, we're not going to wait inside. <laughs> Don't worry. Have you told them yet, Julia? No. They only just arrived. I see, then why don't we... Princess, can we at least save a discussion for inside? Oh, that's right, my apologies. I've been in such a hurry all morning. This way. Oh, I've met everyone else before, but I don't think we had the pleasure. It would seem so. <laughs> I'm the Crown Princess of Liberal, Claudia von Auslesen. Theo Plato, nice to meet you. So, what was it you wanted to ask us, your highness? You have been saying this is a personal matter, but are you really okay with involving us? Of course, when we talked yesterday, I felt that you were definitely the right people for the job. <sighs> Even though I endeavor to fulfill your highness's wishes as much as I am able, she doesn't seem happy about this. I smell trouble. If there is no trouble in the world, we would all be out of a job, wouldn't we? 
what I would ask you to do is to show me around this beautiful city. Wasn't that already on the itinerary? Yes, I believe that the participants of a trade conference were given a guided tour to some major locations. That's so. Randy, it never hurts to keep up to date on the other division schedules, you know. With highlights such as the department store, the police station, the IBC, before ending with a private Archon skill performance. You know all that even though you only arrived yesterday? Naturally, I studied the schedules for all of the VIPs. It is as you say, we had a very pleasant tour of those places yesterday. But those are only part of a true crossbell experience, no? That's only the public face. That's true. It's not exactly representative of daily life. If you're talking about the less glamorous parts of the city, that's a completely different matter. And not one that the officials would want you to see. I want to know the true crossbill. To see with my own eyes what it is like to live here. What it is like to live here? You want to see what we have for lunch? I don't think that's exactly the part she's interested in. Figures, but then what should we do? Simply put, you want to see the ordinary folks living their ordinary lives. Is that correct, Your Highness? Yes, that's exactly it. Nicely put, Lloyd. If I were to assign her a guard detail that would attract undue attention and likely influence the citizens' recent behavior. So Highness wishes to survey the city undercover. Undercover? Wouldn't that leave her unprotected? Underprotected? Not to worry, I believe Prince Oliver also covertly toured the city recently. In the manner of speaking? I'm not sure I would call that covered. It is true that he did conceal his status quite effectively. <laughs> Doing so is necessary if I want to see the real cross with my own eyes. That's what I believe. I personally believe this is far too perilous. Yes, going without guards would be risky. But we can disperse with a guard detail as long as we keep to safe areas. I believe this is an acceptable way to comply with, the, with Her Highness's wishes without unduly compromising on security. That sounds like a good compromise to me, Captain. Please, allow us to help. Thank you. I'm trusting you not only as tour guides, but also to keep Your Highness safe. Yes, sir! Hey, don't get carried away. We are a team, remember? You think this is okay, Lloyd? This isn't something to take lightly. This is a quest from the Crown Princess of a foreign nation. Moreover, it's an effort to get familiar with the city we all love. I believe both parties would greatly benefit from this. I say we do it. I concur. And really, I don't like the thought of letting someone else handle this. We get to help out Captain Schwartz and be of use to the Princess. There could be no greater honor. I take it you're all in favor? Yes, gladly. Thank you. I'll be in your hands. With regards to security in our time budget, I believe we will be able to visit three places in total. I'll leave a choice of which to you. I don't want to see only the bad parts, of course. I would like to see a fair and balanced account of a crossbow lifestyle. A fair and balanced account. So should we include the lunch after all? Or maybe some shopping? That's some. That's a good point. Buying Mishi merchandise is an important part of Crossbell and lifestyle. <laughs> Everyone else disagrees? So, what do we do, Lloyd? Good question. How about we start with... Hmm. They said they were already at the department store. And they were definitely already at Archon Steel. But administrative district, I don't think is... All that interesting to the common people? So, how about we start East Street? It doesn't get much more cross spell than this. The market on East Street. Oh, there are a lot of little stalls here. Look like they're selling fish and vegetables. I've seen food stalls before, but these are a bit different. Oh, so you've seen food stalls before? Yes, there were some stalls at the Royal Academy's Campus Festival. The Campus Festival? Sounds like fun. 
I like these kind of stalls. They show a lot of what Crossbell and life is like. Highness, please remember to keep a low profile. Yes, of course. It gets really crowded here every day just before dinner time. This really is a lively city. Would it be okay if I tried buying something? There aren't a lot of foreigners shopping there, but sure, why not? I don't think anyone would suspect that the princess would be shopping here. I don't know if this was intended like this in the uh, evil version because this is modded in, as I said. But considering that Claudia and Captain Schwartz are here in their uniforms, let's say, call it that, so they're not dressed up at all in any way to disguise their position makes it a bit silly to keep a low profile. Julia, what do you think we should buy? Fish and vegetables? I don't think we need any. Oh, we don't need any, I see. Uh, now, since we're already here, how about we just buy something at random? Yes. This place is pretty normal to us, but they seem to be having fun. Lloyd, where should we go last? Last? Next is, um... Yeah, when you want to see the two cross, but you also need to see downtown. Should we really be here? It's not a place we are proud of, but if you want to see Crossbell in its entirety, this is one facet of it. I understand. It's rather different from the other parts of the city, isn't it? If you want to show me this place, I'll take it. I'm not sure about this. This place isn't exactly safe. Only Lloyd would think of something like this. Isn't he aiming a bit high? Lloyd is always thinking of the best for Crossbell. It is a bit unconventional for a guided tour. Anyway, we absolutely can't let the princess end up in danger. We need exercise extreme caution. What she said. Yes, sir. Engaging maximum sensitivity mode. Well, here we go. Crossbow looks glamorous on the surface. But there are also places like this. Yes. I think they understood what I was trying to convey. Well, to end it off, how about... The famous bakery? This year is a bakery that is popular with people. I think the store is a good representative of Crossbell and daily life. Oh, this shop. I think there is a bug on these two were intended to come along with us, but instead they stand here off screen halfway. <laughs> you see, barely see here half of Captain Schwartz. Oh. And the princess is not there at all, but <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, have you been here before? No, not exactly. But when I was reading up on Crossbell, I saw a report on this store in my newspaper. So I was thinking that I wanted to visit it. What a nice coincidence. That's great. This turned out quite nicely. Don't know if it's coincidence or fate, but hey, it works. It makes me happy when you think that highly of this shop that we visit all the time. Doesn't it? Would it be alright if I try shopping for a bit? We have friends of the people here, so I think it should be fine. Let's go and buy some bread. Julia, you come too. Me too. Very well. I shall accompany you. You're all, of course, welcome to join in. Are you sure? It would be an honor. Getting shopping together with Princess Claudia and Captain Schwartz? I can hardly believe it. Someone pinch me. I must be dreaming. Oh, how pretty. I have, I have to agree. 
such a cozy shop, just like it said in the magazine. Hey Lloyd, welcome. We happen to be in the area, so we thought we'd stop by. I don't think I've ever seen your two friends here before. Are they new in town? Yeah, they're visiting from abroad. They're currently giving a tour of the city. Ah, gotcha. We've been seeing more and more foreigners coming to visit these days. I wonder what kind of breads are popular outside of Crossbell. Ah, uh, good question. If we knew that, that could help us come up with new types of bread. Could you help us out? Are you talking to me? In the country you're from, what sorts of bread are popular, if you don't mind me asking? Um, let me think. I haven't personally visited a bakery before, so I wouldn't know. But it's a country that birthed the acerbic tomato. Would you consider trying to use rose in your bread? Acerbic tomatoes, huh? If you use that right, I think you could make a decent appetizer. Put on some sugar and I think it'll make a surprisingly good vegetable cake. I won't lose. Thanks for the suggestion. I think you've given us some interesting ideas. Is that so? <laughs> I'm glad. Oh, by the way, do people ever tell you that you look really familiar? No, not that I can recall. Ah, I think we're out of time. Oh, I don't feel like it has been that long. But what pains me to say, you must be tidy to today's events. Yes, of course. This is what I came to Crossbell for in the first place. How about we make our way back to the Asail for now? Understood. Good job today. I hope the tour was able to meet your expectations. Not at all. It far exceeded them. Asking the special support section to guide us was a great decision. It was a valuable experience for me as well. I feel that my views have widened. Thank you. It's an honor. I think it was good too, Lloyd. I concur. You chose well. Maybe you can give me a tour next time. Oh, me too. You both know the city better than I do. <laughs> I must thank you again for responding to our call on such short notice. We will have a car take you back to your headquarters. Princess, we need to hurry and prepare. It's alright, I'm already ready to depart. I see. Let us set off then. Captain Schwartz is still so cool. Okay. What else? do we have? We have... Um, Ursula wrote Monster Extermination. Now it wasn't in the way down. At least I haven't found the downward to St. Ursula. So maybe on the side path here? Yeah, that's a big that's a big drum, yeah. yeah. Ah dang it. いくよ。いや。エンゴ。はい。ありがとう。ありがとう。俺の番だな。と。その程度じゃ。俺たちは止められない。ストップ。やってや。奇襲成功。チャンスです。よし。悪いな。先に行かせてもらうよ。You cannot be slain.
and you're generally immune to all status effects. Giant Drome, a giant mollusk that manipulates electrical arts, sports impressive regenerative abilities. Mm. いくよ。無駄だよ。いや。やれやれ。無駄だよ。はい。電磁ネット。任せろ。そうだ。行くぞ。行くよ。無駄だよ。カブリ、カブリ。それ。私の番ですね。はあ。よっしゃ。くらいな。俺の番だな。行くよ。Terminated the monster on Ursula Road. Obtained craft book Akasha. It's one of those craft books, if I'm not mistaken. At first glance, the contents seem to be a good fit for Ellie and Vazi's combat styles. Would you like to give it a try, Vazi? Why, absolutely! Ellie and Vazi learned Akashic Star. Either of those quests. So I guess I ended here. Yeah, um, not much of a choice. Good, then until next time, I'd say, amazing, don't get lost. <laughs>